Welcome to episode 1500 of the Multifamily Collective. So it's a milestone day for us. 1,500 episodes. And the reality of it is we actually have, I think, 1,700 episodes. But the first 200 episodes, plus or minus, are, uh, let's say, the just warm-up for what we're doing today. And even today, I would consider a warm-up for what we will be doing uh, one to three to five years from now. So we're learning every day, but uh, I appreciate the multifamily collective community, the people who tune in every day, or the people who tune in from time to time. I think we are uh, building a, we're building a base that will support a very strong community in the coming two to five years, plus or minus. We're, we're building something for the future. And uh, once that thing launches and goes prime time, I think we'll uh, have collected in the multifamily collective uh, a very astute set of multifamily professionals that uh, would like to be challenged intellectually on a daily basis, uh, on a weekly basis, on a monthly basis, and we'll create a community out of this that I think will be vibrant and long lasting and driven by the community, not by a person. So anyway, all that being said, today's episode <laughs> is about the pace of change. And I heard an interesting quote yesterday, I want to share it with the community, and, and that quote is this, or it's not really a quote, it was just a, a statement, uh, maybe a philosophy that was shared and that that is that if the pace of change outside of your organization is happening at a more rapid pace than it is internal to your organization, then there's a good chance, there's a very good chance that you will go out of business in the not too distant future or your business will be severely handicapped as it relates to your competitors who are changing at a more rapid pace or staying up with the pace of change that is outside of your organization. So consumers are demanding uh, experiences outside of the multifamily industry that when they become residents in your communities or they become customers of your property management company, their expectations and dare I say demands of your organization are grounded in something that they experience outside of your organization. So, so suffice it to say, you need to make sure that your organization is nimble, it's agile, it is ever-changing. Everything in your organization is always subject to, whether it be processes, disciplines, systems, routines, doesn't matter. Everything is subject to all the time. Sacred cows must go out the window. If you have a something internal to your organization that is your baby that you've been fostering and nurturing and keeping alive for a very long bit of time, but it is hamstringing your organization. If, if there is some sort of compliance married around that, that is literally choking off progress in your organization, you have to do away with it. You have to put all egos aside. You have to make sure everything in your organization is subject to you. And you have to make sure that you are evolving and changing, at least matching the pace of what is happening outside of your organization, if not exceeding the pace of change outside of your organization. So that is it for our 1500 episode. Love to hear your thoughts. Take care. We'll talk to you again soon.